Okay, we get a lot of questions about how to properly inflate our tubes in the tube cover. So when you get the tube, you'll have your tube cover. This is the red one here. Um, you'll have to fold it out, lay it out wherever you're going to blow it up. Um, then you have your recreational tube. Fold that out. And find the inlet here. Right here, remove the mushroom cap. <clears throat> These tubes are recreational, so they're meant to be outside. They're not inner tubes like you find that goes in a truck tire. These are formulated rubber to be outside in the weather, the rain, the wet, the snow, the cold. Um, <clears throat> so, I'm going to lay everything out like that, and then I like to put the valve towards the front when I do these and put it in here. spread it out where it would go. Now you can blow these up if you have to with a pump. I don't recommend that. If you've got an air compressor handy or something like that, that's the best way to do it. So we've got our air compressor hose here. Um, basically we're just going to start filling it up and as we see it fill up we're going to position the tube in there properly the way we want it to go so that it fills the whole tube and isn't lopsided. The best way to do these is to fill them up, like get your inner tube, fill it up to where it's kind of full, about halfway. And then I would probably do these like this and then maybe walk away for a bit and let that rubber kind of start to stretch the way that it needs to stretch because it's been folded up in a box for a long time. Okay, so now that we've let it sit for a little bit and just kind of get used to its new shape, um, get the wrinkles out, what we're going to do is just completely fill this all the way up. And we want to fill it up um, until the cover is nice and full, but we don't want the inner tube to start to wrinkle. Um, we want to make sure we keep any bulges out on one side. That's why we let it rest a little bit. If you don't let it rest, you may get a bulge on one side. So now that we've let it rest, we're just going to add air until the cover is nice and full. And you may have to adjust the inner tube a little bit as you go. You don't have to worry about popping these as they're going up. You just don't want it to create any wrinkles or anything like that. If you start to see a crease form somewhere or a bulge, just wait a minute and give it just a little bit of time to fill the rest of the way up. Give it a little bit of time to, uh, to adjust. But this one did pretty good, so it's... Uh, it's full and it's, it's ready to go. Ready for fun in the snow. So we hope you guys take them out. Have a great time. Don't forget to put your cap back on there and your mushroom cap. You're ready to go tubing. <laughs>